intros to your video is always so awkward for me like ugh. good morning everyone today is friday kevin is at work and unfortunately he has to be at work for a long time today so I, we probably won't see him till probably like seven or eight o'clock tonight which means it's just going to be a relaxing day for me and Brielle, which also means you probably won't be seeing him in this vlog today, but that's okay. There's always tomorrow because tomorrow is Saturday and he has Saturday and Sunday off. If you didn't know by now, I am a stay-at-home mom. I love being a stay-at-home mom because I am able to watch my baby grow and reach all her milestones and I get to help her learn and I just get to experience motherhood. My lips are so dry. And I'm I'm grateful for the hard work that Kevin does so that I am able to be a stay-at-home mom. So thank you, Kevin. Don't say I, I never thanked you. Some mothers choose to work even if they were able to be a stay-at-home mom because they, they probably feel they need to like just get out of the house and do their own thing make their own money which is awesome like good for you everyone you know has their own life just does their own things one of the jobs I used to have was working at a daycare so I always wanted to surround myself around you know just caring for babies tending to their needs and having that kind of responsibility so even though I don't get paid for this job it's very rewarding in different different ways so I'm happy. We have been up since 7.30 this morning and Brielle has only had one nap and it was for 20 minutes and it is now almost 12.30 so <laughs> she's still on the floor doing her thing, playing. I don't know when she'll have her nap but it's probably soon. So what I do as a stay at home mom is I do have a routine that I go by pretty much every day it's like it, it's pretty much um i wake up in the no in the morning um brielle usually is awake before me i nurse her and then we i get her ready for the day then we i bring her downstairs to play on her mats and then um i like to do one-on-one -on -one with her as in like i like to sing with her she tries to sing along i talk with her i play with her as well um and all that fun stuff. I try to stimulate her. And then um, usually after like two hours she gets she goes down for her nap. But sometimes like today she doesn't always take her nap. We You're okay, honey. Then after her nap we um, play again and I read to her even though obviously she doesn't understand but I tried to like sing the alphabet to her. I had these little books for her. Then then I let her relax and just chill in her swing for a little bit so that I can do you know like house things such as the, the dishes, laundry, picking up, vacuuming and then taking care of our animals as well. My girl just farted really loud girlfriend you good over there i'm kind of weird i do enjoy vacuuming i don't know it just like makes me feel good knowing like our carpet is clean and our dog sheds like no tomorrow oh my gosh kind of stresses me out but i mean he's a dog so he does dog things i like to get brielle ready for the day before i get ready for the day and that's kind of an obvious like some days i won't even get ready like today it may look like I'm kind of ready. My hair is always just weird looking, but like I have a shirt and then like a little, what do you call this? Well, I wear this over it and honestly, I'm wearing sweatpants and you wouldn't, ha wouldn't have known that until now since I showed you. And then when Kevin gets out of work, we make dinner together sometimes depending on like what we're making. So I usually wait to make dinner until he comes home unless it's like a crock pot meal which i love so if you guys have any crock pot recipes comment them below because i am obsessed it's so easy so simple and yummy food so yes comment below any recipes you guys have can you say hi say hi 
Thick in morning. You have yet to take your nap, girlfriend. Look how cute. I usually just keep her in onesies throughout the day because over here, well, I guess I should show my face when I'm talking. Over here in Arizona, it gets to like 120, depending on the day, like 120 degrees. So far, it hasn't reached that high yet, but I'm pretty sure it will soon because right now it's like, pretty sure it's in the, it's like 100 degrees out right now. So I'd rather not layer her on too much in this heat. I mean, it's not humid here, so it's dry heat, which is nice. But yeah, i rather just keep her in a onesie, but sometimes I will, you know, keep, put shorts on her, you know, so, yeah. Hello, Duke. Can I help you? What are you smelling? She's literally sucking on my thumb right now. Are you gonna be a thumb sucker? I was a thumb sucker. No one liked the fact that I sucked my thumb when I was younger, but I mean, Whatever. I also had a blankie, and man, I was obsessed with that blankie. I have my grandma to thank for that. What are you doing? When are you gonna take your nap, honey? We just ordered her the amber teething necklace. So, I'm hoping that works. We'll see what happens. Um, Miss Brielle, is going to be four months old tomorrow. Like, how crazy is that? How has it already been four months? I don't understand. My little girl's growing up. Oh, honey, you good? So today, since Kevin won't be home till way later, I think I'm going to relax with baby girl, um, do some house stuff. Our kitchen needs some love right now. So I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna catch up on some social media, and then hopefully she will be taking her nap by then. Like I was saying, she's gonna be four months old tomorrow. So for those who wanna see some four month pictures that I will be taking, check out my Instagram. I have my username below, so check that out. Or my Twitter, I like to post pictures of her on my Twitter. And Snapchat, like I post pictures of her like every day on Snapchat. like. Yeah, those are my three go-to things if you want to see more of my girlfriend. That's her nickname, I guess. I guess today her nickname is girlfriend and sometimes other days her nickname is peanut butter. Like, like where do I come up with these things? Can you tell a baby lives here? This is definitely baby central right now. Yeah, you take over. are done they're in the dishwasher as well and if you can hear Brielle she still has not taken her nap and it has been six hours since she woke up for the day it was only one 20 minute nap so I guess you can say she's tired so what I think I'm gonna do is take her on a walk around the uh, neighborhood and hopefully that puts her to sleep. But that means I have to put actual pants on. Also, if our house seems cluttered or anything, it's really not, it's just that we have a really small house on base, so. We work with what we get. You ready for our walk? Let's hope she naps. Yeah. 
You like that toy. Well, as you guys can tell, the walk definitely worked. She's finally taking her nap and oh my gosh. Let me just show you so you know that we're, we're not exaggerating about the heat. You can see my reflection, but this is what we're looking at right now. It's not even that hot, but <laughs> look at me. It's not even that hot, but it gets worse. Look at that. Crazy. So I think it's time that we cool. <laughs> I think it's time we get inside and cool down and let's see how long she naps for. Oh, also, I got some packages. One for my grandma and one for Kevin, but it's a Father's Day gift, so shh, don't tell him. We just got back from the walk and it was so, it felt like a forever long walk, but it really wasn't. It was maybe like 15, 20 minutes, but in this heat, it felt like forever and I show I you guys saw that it was 93 here and I was like oh it's not that and I was like it's not that hot but what I meant was that it definitely gets hotter this is like pretty much the beginning and you saw the rest it was like 100 whatever so yeah it's hot and she's still sleeping and that package that I got when I got back to the house it was for my grandma and you in the I told you what the other thing was it's for Kevin my grandma is so cute and she got Brielle some baby clothes and I think it's just cute she is actually she lives in the East Coast and that's where we're from so thank you grandma I don't know if you'll be if you'll watch this but thank you this they're so cute I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys this one says and sassy it's a three to six month definitely describes Brielle <laughs> that's cute and this one's my favorite this one's nine months and it's like I can't think of what this is called farmer jeans I believe but well look at how cute this is like seriously come on now I wish they had an adult sized one Grandma, you got some good taste. You got some good taste. Braille's gonna look so cute in this when she fits in it. Isn't that adorable? Oh my gosh. I also wanna share with you guys the fact that I am wearing my first shorts since having Brielle. And they're American Eagle. I've had these shorts for a really long time. They're still in good condition, but the, the scary thing is that they're a size zero and I'm wearing them right now. I don't know how they still fit because I'm really like a size one, size two, depending on like the material and where you got them from. So I guess that's kind of why I can still fit in them because they're from American Eagle. But I was sure I was not going to fit in these shorts, but I'll show you guys what they look like. They might be too short, but they still fit me, so yeah. So these are the shorts. They are size zero, and look at that. Amazing. <laughs> well, that nap lasted a whole good hour. Oh, oh my goodness. What did you just do? Did you just spit up? Oh goodness, I gotta clean that up now. I switched her to this playmat instead of this one because she was laying on that blanket but as you guys saw she spit up on it and I don't have the, the actual mat area for that yet it's still in the kitchen so we moved to here do you are you just like not a napper today you just want to stay up and play with mama is that true dog hair on your face. Give me that. Give me that hair. Let's show them what you do. Hmm. <laughs> 
You're just the cutest little Tushi. You're just the cutest. What's the matter? What? Did something bother you? Do you want to roll? Want to roll over? Oh. Boo boo boo. So I guess this is what my hair looks like at the end of the day. Um, well, I think I'm gonna just end it here because I'm hungry, Brielle and I are just gonna play, and Kevin's still working, so we're not gonna really do much for the rest of the day, so I'm gonna end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's pretty much like what I do. Uh, I'm not going to show you like everything because then you're going to be like, okay, that's cool. She did that. She <laughs> she folded that laundry. You now she's doing more laundry. Baby clothes are never ending. But I love being a stay-at-home mom. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you want to see more daily videos of what we do. And upcoming is her appointment. Um my appointments and all that fun stuff. So stick around if you want to watch and keep up and stay updated. Tomorrow she's gonna be four months old. So like I said earlier, if you want to see all these pictures that I will most likely be posting of her tomorrow, check my Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter. So yeah, thank you guys for watching and see you tomorrow. Bye.